Wednesday night, the men's basketball team put their four-game win streak on the line as the Raging Cajuns came to town for a midweek conference showdown. Also returning to town was the many students gearing up for the spring semester and showed up to support their Trojans. And they did not disappoint. Although it was a close game and down to the last minute, Troy pulled off a clutch run in the closing moments to make the gap too big for the Cajuns to close. Head coach Scott Cross gave us his like and dislikes from the matchup and what he took away from it. The best thing about it was the fact that we were able to turn them over 20 times and get 16 steals. That showed that we had a high level of activity defensively. Um, you know, I think we have to pride ourselves on the defensive end of the floor. Any, any given guy on any given night can be the hot hand for us. We've got enough weapons, enough players, but collectively we had to clamp down defensively. And I felt like for the most part our guys were pretty locked in defensively today. An important aspect of this game in particular was the physicality of it. We all know basketball is a very physical sport. There may not be guys running at you full speed and trying to put you in a hospital like football, but it's still physical nonetheless. This game was a shining standpoint of that as more than 40 free throws were taken by the final buzzer. It seemed that almost every play there was some sort of contact and depending on if the ref called it changed the course of the game. So to sum it up, the fans got a little bit of MMA mixed in with their basketball game. Coach Cross gave us his pro tips for staying calm when things get more physical than normal. Example. I probably have to be better with that and just, you know, I think sometimes just taking a deep breath and relaxing is the best medicine for that. Um, you know, you want to be amped up defensively, but on the other end, offensively, you have to relax, you have to play loose. Um, so sometimes, yeah, just taking a deep breath is the best thing for that. But our guys are older. We got some experienced guards. You know, Spuds, that's not his first rodeo. You know, Tayden's a Juco All-American. Uh, so we have some guys that have been through the ropes and, you know, understand what it takes, and they did a good job uh, making plays down the stretch. Amir Muhammad as well, another one that's been here for, you know, numerous years. And so those guys are so good with the basketball. We just, you know, have trust in them, and they made plays down the stretch for us. With the 79-73 to victory, the Trojans pushed that win streak up to five now. And one last note, the Trojans are 4-0 and in conference play so far this season their best start since the 2003 through 2004 season. Parker Flowers, Troy, Trojan Vision News.